Welcome back, one and all, to South Park, the Fractured what Butthole. What the hell's wrong with you? A lot, actually. Anyway, I am the Dark Seraph, and last time... Oh, I get the names I often get the names mixed up. I am the Amazing Butthole, and last time... We took down an Italian crown family, embraced the power of diabetes, and got the ability to move heavy objects. Alright, my lord. It's time for us to get the information we need from Classy. Any good superhero should know how to interrogate. Get over to Jimmy's house and find out what she knows. Keen, act. Yeah, later. Yo, bro, get over here. I'm the world's strongest diabetic superhero. I think you're the only one. Now I go off on an exploration. Veal roll ups, the fuck? Round by the lake. Hello. Hey there, little menace to society. Don't you look snappy today? Don't make me put up my dukes. Go ahead. Rusty syringe, the f a tent. A cheesing vial. Oh, another Yowie. Golden Sparkle Day. Ned's P.O. key. Okay, I can get into somebody's P.O. box now. Another fast travel point. How do you do? In the old days before cell phones, if you got separated at the mall, you had to find a new family. Is that what happened to you? Cosmic clasps recipe? Wow! They're more or less the same. Let's go with that one, just because, you know, I spent the time to actually make it. Hey man, where's Jasper? I don't know. I haven't seen him in like three days. You think he's in trouble? Maybe we should tell his parents or something, dude. No way, man. Parents are dumb. He probably just found some porn.
So yeah, before I actually do a whole lot of anything, I'm just going to explore. You can go back to the Peppermint Hippo if you want. Not much of a point to. Actually, there is a point to. If the game will load, that is. Esther, look! It's the farting vigilante! Oh, cool! I guess. You're turning into kind of a big deal, new kid. What do you say? Selfie? Yeah. Okay, well, full disclosure. Esther's not following you, so I'm not following you, so don't tag me. Thanks. Wow, you have a lot of followers for a new kid, new kid. You can tag me in that if you want. You sure showed those bad people last night. Here, kitty, kitty. Oh, here, forthy, forthy. Busy. You. Have you spoken to Craig recently? I think he uh he could use a friend right now. You're a creep. So I'm gonna go up to I'm gonna go up to Main Street to the Peppermint Hippo. Hey there, I'm Tally, your gaming bud. Yeah, how are you? Break? You can't break that with your snapping pops. You're gonna need an explosion. to prophecy. Yeah, all that for costume. Pretty cool. It, I guess. Can't do anything with that yet. That was my phone. That was my phone again. God, I feel like I've been waiting three years for this bus. You have. Shut up. Yeah, I already know that. In fact, the fireworks aren't even here anymore. Hey, Forthy, want to see a naked picture of your mom? No, not really.
Now that that bouncer's gone, I can just come right back in here. You one of them little folks? Oh yeah, you can just find uh, you can find another one there apparently. Jimbo's wallet. You can take that to the gun store. Like shit's really hitting the fan. A microbrewery. And now you got a problem. Oh with yeah, me. this guy. I'm not just gonna sit here and do nothing while you insult this man's ethnicity. I wasn't insulting him. Excuse me. Did you or did you not say that this man seemed tired? Yes, he's my friend. I said, Hollow, you look tired. Microaggression! Ah. That's not a microaggression. Ah. Persons of Hispanic backgrounds have been stereotyped as being sleepy and saying they look tired is a microaggression that will not stand. But I am tired. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I just him. You're the new kid, right? I'm the principal of your school. My name is PC Principal. I was You're told dick. you to talk to me about some race issues. Okay, come at me. You're just a self righteous douchebag. That's all you are. That's all people like him are. Are just these self-righteous douchebags. Come on, you want to learn about race, right? Give me your best shot. It's a nice day, isn't it? Mm, yes, very good. That was indeed not a microaggression. All right, round two. I ate a hamburger last week. All right, that was also not a microaggression. Unless you're this a vegan. This time I'm use a microaggression, and you will see how it gives you a free shot. All right, everybody, listen up. I'm about to use a microaggression, but it's only for the use of training this young person in the ways of the social justice warrior. Thank you, microaggression, about to happen. Thank you. No one gives a shit. My friend Brian looks like a chick. Microaggression, hit him. Oh, oh. Not bad, kid, not bad at all. Not only is the word chick derogatory to females, but also criticizing a male for looking feminine is a microaggression towards a person of transgender. Now let's see yes, if this yes, microaggression that's... is more subtle. My pants are warm. My pants are warm. TMI, dude. That coffee belongs to Tim Sherman. Tim's a dick. I heard it's going to rain. Rains is nice. Janet likes to roller skate. Skating sucks. Mr. Yamashiro is actually a very good driver. Microaggression! Hit him! Not really, that's more context than anything. Uh, uh. Nice kid, very nice indeed. Using the term actually inferred that maybe other Asian Americans are not good drivers. And the use of Mr. is offensive to persons of third gender. Now, Fuck before off. we talk about your race, I need you to get out there and do some PC work for me. I'll let you know when I think you're ready. God damn it. Remember, kid, people use microaggressions every day. I'm counting on you to make them pay for doing so. You can tell I don't, I'm not a fan of PC Principal. I, I know the joke is he's the self-righteous douchebag, but I genuinely don't like people like that. They're annoying as hell because they are self-righteous douchebags. We're only doing so based off of trends, and not openly to be a good person. Just doing what that bullshit just because it's popular. And look at me, I'm such a good person. Hey, 
Hey, look, it's Shitty Walk. New items on menu, very special. I can't believe I... Too busy making shitty chicken now. You come back another time. Take all the pre. What a shitty item you want today. <laughs> Thank you for all the... Okay, bye-bye. Too busy making shitty chicken now. You come back another time. Okay. We recycle casings. Hey, that's a good thing. Recy Clean your shells up, people. Don't leave your brass around. Oh, man. It's butthole. Mm, okay. <laughs> I was out last night at the hippo and lost my wallet. If you find it, I'll give you a reward. Holy crap, you found it! Listen here, Vigilante. If you're ever in trouble, you give me a net a holler, and we'll shoot the shit out of whatever's bothering you. And that's super helpful. Hot damn, I just gotta get one of them selfie things with the party patriot. Thanks! I'll swipe right you on Coopstagram. <laughs> That's, uh... What does that say? Uh... Ammo isn't... Ammos aren't cheap. Don't expect a warning shot. <laughs> That's awesome. You should channel your energy into a cause, kid. Maybe knit iPad covers for homeless people. Never mind. Gosh, darn it, I don't think that vigilante's setting a good example for the young folks. I don't take kindly to folks who take selfies, but let's take one anyway. I don't care for selfies either. I think they're kind of dumb. Great, see you later, kid. Remember when Superman movies weren't so depressing? Oh yeah, I remember. Oh, I remember. Remember when Batman's bat suit had nipples? Of course I remember, but I wish I didn't, maybe. <laughs> here, kitty, kitty. Oh, here, forthy, forthy. I got this.
Yeah, this is important for later. And my dog. Give me a minute. Sorry for that cut there. I don't even know what my dog was barking at. I didn't see anything. Pack. Patriot bar. Okay. I'm back at the lake. <clears throat> Pond, whatever. A cat, but I can't do anything with that right now. Can I go into the graveyard? No. Go on through. Hey, little crime stopper, back for more? I got something you might be interested in. Turns out that scum you fucked up is just the low guy on the totem pole. We now believe the real kingpin is over here, on your phone, that I'm holding right now. Thanks for letting me hold your phone to show you this. He's hiding out in some big luxury mansion bought with blood money, scumbag. This is a whole nother level, little crime fighter. His house is like a fortress. Every window and door is wired to a state-of-the-art, high-tech security system. You'll need this. This mobile hacking device will help you bypass the security system. Good hunting, hero. I just go into the women's restroom through there. This one's gonna be a bit more tricky. It's so much easier on the PlayStation. Hold on a second. Okay, I'm just paranoid. Thought I heard something. It's just it was nothing. Sorry for the another for the second cut in the same video. Honda's wig. Violated that guy's civil rights with gusto. You'd make a great cop. Very funny. Kinda busy, kid. Maybe later.
Hello there, welcome to the soft room. I'm a friendly detective. What's your name? Karen no Doll. Let me know if you need to sit down and talk things out. Sure. So exactly why are you wandering around the police station? Do you have information about who's behind the big crime wave in South Park? I understand how this attention must be scary for you. You know what else is scary? Choking on Jared's $5 footlong. <laughs> I wrote that myself. I actually do stand-up on the weekends. Here's my headshot. You know, with this crime wave, I'm looking for work. You take my headshot around town, and I'll let you see what's in my bottom drawer here in my desk. Want to see what's in my bottom drawer? Huh? Uh, Wait, sure. My... Go ahead, get my headshot out there, and I'll give you a treat. Hey, you help me out, I help you out. Pretty much anywhere there's a bulletin board, put his headshot. Here, pussy pussy. Okay, fine, I'll kick uh, your ass. Looks like I'm gonna catch me some fourthies. Master Privilege Checker. <laughs> On behalf of my constituents, I'd like to thank you for your service. What kid doesn't love a photo with the highest ranking official of their municipal government? Very good. Now run along, little constituent. Why, yes, I love engaging in social media activities. It's so important. Not really. Great, maybe I'll see this one on the social media. Let's take a picture, future voter. <laughs> on behalf of the entire mayor's office, thank you for your support. Let me open it! Fine. And we wander and we wander and we wander on some more. I wander on the left and I wander to the right. I'll look in here. Oh, ah, it's this creepy Martin guy. Vigilante. Do you have a few moments to answer some questions? Sure. What's next for the farting vigilante? Your mother. I'm flattered, kid, but a superhero's got to be pretty special to impress me.
The farting vigilante stinks. I'd rather not go have a man arrested. You'll never get in here, super fool. Don't want to. We just got in. Come back when you get that sloppy seconds itch. Sorry, I'm not much for selfies. Neither am I. Gee, could that be? Nah. Wrong button. I'm not gonna bother going in there yet. in combat. Use the fart to gross them out and punch them while they're up chucking. Yeah, I know how it works. Thank you. That is good advice, though, so I can't complain too much. Okay, I can't go up that direction yet. No, not today. What's wrong, Chicken? Yes. Oh, hey, little superhero. I know you're out there saving kitties. If you come across any of my kitties and there's pink scarves, can you bring them back to me? I can't find them anywhere. My kitties are being hunted by those mean sixth graders. If you see any of my furry babies, come talk to me. Okay, honey buns? I need a specific fart power to save his cats. Nope. Not in the mood. Oh, uh, is a little fourthy of Wade? Poor yes. baby. Hey. Yes, I'm completely terrified by a hormonal teenager. You can call your little friend Scott to tip over a super heavy object like that one. He'll be happy to help. Yes, I know. Okay, let's do this. Got a yowie. Reverse Lotus. Yay. Here, kitty, kitty. Come on, kitty. This is Jimmy's house. Hi, Classy. Oh, it's you again. Sup, hero? Don't be farting in my face and shit. Hey, Fast Pass, one of your super homies is here. Oh, hey, new kid. The coon told me he wants you to question the witness, so go ahead, have at it. Go ahead, new kid. Ask her anything you want. Oh, that's smart. Using the silent treatment can really make a witness a anti. I look, I know y'all need my help and shit, but I ain't talking to you. Go get my medication. 
Y your medication? Yeah, I can't think straight without my medication. You gotta go pick up my prescription, all right? Until you get my prescription, I ain't telling you little heroes fuck all nothing. Well, all right, fine. Looks like you got more work to do, new kid. But before you go back out in the world, I want to show you something that might help your crime fighting. Let's get up to my room, to bed. All right, new kid. It's time to take your superpowers to the next level. Go ahead and stand in the DNA fibulator. Uh, right here. All right, new kid, just stand still and I'll talk you through this. Check out the new hero DNA slot I opened up for you. Stuff you insert here will make a big impact on your combat pa pa your combat pa effectiveness. Pick the one that best suits your power loadout. Just keep in mind that a big damage boost may mean less health, or vice versa. Kind of like how steroids shrink your buffs. Or so I've read. Yeah, you took steroids. Okay, let's see. High pain threshold. More health. And your ginger DNA. My lower intelligence, I don't even know what intelligence does. Okay, that's more damage, but less health. Knockback. Okay, brains is range. Brawn is knockback. And Hmm. Yeah, I'll take right. that. Now you know what real power feels like. Pretty dang good. That should do it, new kid. Hope you have a grasp of it. Now get out there and kick some booty. I'm pretty sure I took a shit in your toilet. Yes. You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. You know what I'm saying? Sure, I'll take a selfie with Jimmy's friend. Thanks, honey. See you on Coonstagram. Let's do it. Thanks for helping Jimmy out. It doesn't bother you. Your parents must doesn't bother you that there's a stripper on your couch? No? Okay. I wonder if I actually have to go get that guy in prison. This is the human kite. You know that little problem you helped me take care of? Well, it's back. Can you come to my house ASAP, please? Uh, sure, but I'm gonna end this one here because I've been going a while. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on South Park the Factory But Hole as I help out my friends, get some information, and maybe get a man arrested. I'm a good person. I, I, I honestly am a good person.